All right, y'all, so of course, Liv has the kids now. Of course, it's her time. And it's really, it's really infuriating, to say the least, because Christian missed out on his awards, his last game. Now, of course, Gerard and Antonisha were there to accept his trophies and his awards, but it was just really sad. Didn't Liv say she wanted to meet the coach? It's really crazy to me how Liv could have actually took Christian to this game, been there for his awards, you know, supported him in something that he's been doing for a while, met the coach, met the other parents, saw the other kids, you know, created some type of bond with these people because clearly Christian is going to be playing football again, whether she likes it or not. It's like there's common sense and then there's Liv and they just never connect. I don't understand. She told everybody online that she wanted to go to his game. She wanted to go to his practices. She wanted to meet his coach. Like... These are things you could have done if you brought your child to the actual game he was going to be in. I mean, what is going on? I, like I said, the pills should not be for weight loss. And of course, she's on Instagram posting really cute stuff with the kids. You know, Robin singing and doing all that. They're watching TV. Christian's sitting right next to her and Brian on her lap. I mean, of course, she told them to sit next to her and sit on her lap so that she can take a quick, quick little video. I mean, clearly. Talking about he never leaves her side. Yes, he does. Every time he goes to his father's house. Bye. Now, does anybody know how long she is going to have the kids? Is it for a couple weeks? Is it for one week? Is it for the weekend? Like, what do y'all think? Because I'm not sure. I don't know if she said it already. But are we going to see them do stuff for Christmas? You know, set up the tree. I guess she already did that. Um, decorate. She kind of did that already. What is she going to do with the kids? What is she going to do? And isn't Ryan's hair so cute? Shout out to Antonisha because she really does keep those girls' hair very nice. And I did catch the comment where Liv said that there's a bald spot for on Robin's hair. There's a bald spot from being braided so often. Girl, <laughs> and then she gonna say that if Robin wants to cut her hair again, she will cut it. What? See, I love how she talks about how with Gerard, he can post their kids, post anything he wants about their kids. She doesn't have a problem with it. When every time he posts something, she has a problem with it and starts talking about it and gets an attitude. Okay, but then with cutting her daughter's hair, she doesn't have to talk to him. Like, that has nothing to do with him. She's going to do it if she wants to. Why? Her hair is beautiful. Why? This is just another reason why people are going to call Liv a colorist. Because, think about it, she doesn't want to keep up with her daughter's hair. She is going to cut it off at will whenever she wants to or whenever her daughter wants her to. It's just really sad. Hopefully she doesn't because Antonisha really grew her hair really beautifully. It looks really nice and just leave her hair alone, please. I feel really bad for the kids because she's probably over there right now talking so much crap about Antonisha, talking about their father, Gerard. She's probably doing a lot to try and get the kids against them. And it's just sad because she makes it seem like Gerard is the one doing that to her when we continuously see her doing it to them. Like, no. So now that she has the kids, she wants to post positive stuff on her Instagram, like everything's great and everything's gonna work in her favor. Girl, the kids are gonna go back with their father. We already know, okay? I don't know the timeline yet, but they're not gonna stay with you forever. Y'all are both the parents and y'all both need time. All I could think about when I saw this, oh, he never leaves my side thing that she posted on her Instagram is just, the baby shower and how she yelled at Christian for no reason. It was just so sad. You could tell he was so confused, so upset. And I'm sure at that moment, he was just ready to be with his father and not her. You could tell. Do y'all think she's going to post some videos with the kids on her channel? I'm kind of thinking she probably will. That's probably what she's doing, you know, editing, getting it together right now. But I don't know. I wonder how long the kids are going to be with her. I'm really upset that she didn't take Christian to his game because what was the reason? you got the information, but I guess because Christian doesn't really want to play, right? Thank y'all so much for watching this video. Definitely let me know all of your thoughts and opinions down in the comment section about the whole live situation down below, and I will definitely see you in the next one.